What's up, y'all? This is Rain Man, and this is going to be my um, thoughts about the J10 interview with Fago Lovers. Now, that interview was interesting. I mean, to me, it was interesting. You know what I mean? They were talking. We, we, knew, we know more about J10 now, like how he became Blaze's hype man, what problems he had with Violent J, how he considered Blaze as a close homie, how he got out of Psychopathic, um, and what really happened at the night when, um, you know, when Twisted and Blaze got arrested by the cops for recharges. Now, like I said, that shit was interesting. It took an hour long, but that was interesting to me, you know, and to a lot of other juggles too. I bet you it's interesting just to hear that shit, no matter what, you know? And, um, you know, my thoughts about it, hey, you know what? That's their drama. That's their drama, and I'm not really concerned with their drama. I just want to hear the music, you know? I mean, their drama is their drama. The music is what I really want, you know? Um, and, um, you know, I bet you anything, a lot of jugglers are going to start, are going to try to take sides now. Try to take sides and get inside that drama. They're going to try to get in it. Want to know how? Okay, well, first off, let's, let's say this, okay? Um, they're going to take sides because that's what um, a lot of jugglers are starting to do nowadays, you know? They're going to try to take sides whether it's not their drama, you know? Whether it's their drama or not, they're going to take sides. And, um, you know, they're going to be going like, you know what? Fuck J10. He's still a little bitch. He shouldn't have dissed jugglers. He shouldn't have said fuck jugglers. He shouldn't have made a diss for ICP, for Violent J, for Blaze the Dead Homie. You know what, fuck that, I'm a juggalo, and I'm with Violent J on this shit, whoop whoop motherfuckers, and then people would be going on J10's side, be going like, you know what, fuck Violent J, he shouldn't have said that shit, and what kind of a man, what kind of a homie Blaze is, whenever he says you want to get even, fuck Sugar Slam, you know, so you know what, fuck Violent J, fuck, fuck all the motherfuckers, I'm with J10 on this, don't get into their drama, that's not your drama, that's their drama, um, are you there for their drama, for their everyday life, or are you there, are you there just for the music, you know, for the music and family love, you know, and, you know, one thing I gotta agree with J10, one thing I really agree with is when he said, you know what, jugglers are not what they are now, what they used to be back then, you know, and that shit made a lot of sense, you know. If you're an old school juggler, you know exactly what he means by that. You know, I mean back ten, back then, um, you know it was way different. It was the good times. You know, it was actually the times where we didn't fight a lot. But now uh, we're all fighting. We're all starting to lose that family love just because of what Violent J's drama with um, J10, J10's problem with Psychopathic Records. We're gonna lose family love because of their with their drama, come on now. I mean, I don't care who Violent J has a fight with, you know. Um, I'll be honest with this. Drama does, drama is entertaining though. Drama is entertaining. You cannot deny that, you know. If you are a huge wrestling fan, wrestling, the WWE is full of drama. So, you know, even if wrestling is fake, scripted, whatever you want to call it, um, it still holds drama. Reality shows, they have dramas. Um, TV, Batman, you know, with the TV shows, the cartoons, they have, he has drama, you know. There's going to be drama everywhere, you know. And the, here's the thing, drama is what makes the story more, more good, you know. And, um, I mean, yeah, you have to admit that drama does equals, drama equals entertainment, you know. And, um. You know, don't don't go along with this. Like, don't choose sides. You know, it's because then you're going. Then y'all can go back to that Eminem versus ICP beef. You know, I mean, a lot of jugglers are saying, you know what, fuck Eminem, fuck Eminem, and then um, ever since um, you know, that shit happened, we started to take people started to take sides no matter what. You know, they started they they had to take sides. Either you're with the fam or against the fam. You know, and you know, don't. Don't recreate this stuff, okay? Don't choose sides. Don't get into their drama. That's their drama, like I said. And um, you know, yeah, what Jay said. What if we only heard J10 side? You know, we need to hear Violent J side. Now there's like there, now there's three sides of the story. 
there's J10 side, there's Violent J side, along with some psychopathic members, and there's the truth, all right? That's the that's the way it is, you know? And, um, you know, the truth is out there. Either one of them's holding it, they're both holding it, or no one is holding the truth, you know? And, um, I mean, that's all I got to say. There's my thoughts. I mean, the story was interesting. There was a lot of stuff that, would, that made me go like, wow, that's crazy, you know? I mean, but, yeah, that's my thoughts, you know, and, um, yeah, peace.